everyone, I'm Dalos, and we are round, almost done with this, with this box. This is the July 2017 Japan Grand. I'll tell you something right now. This time we're going to be taking a look at the premium items. The items you can only get if you got the premium box from July 2017. Japan Grand Scourge Box Service, we can get all kinds of great Japanese snacks and such from, right from Tokyo for one low price. And in the case of premium box, that's 30 bucks. I haven't paid that for a better part of two years or something like that, so... And you know what? I know quality when I see it, and... Oh, we'll talk about that later. Right now, though, I had to get some preparation done beforehand, because... Ah, uh, thing. First up is... Let me hold it! Let me hold it! Okay. Melon Soda! Look at that little guy. That little guy is... Looks like you could eat your face. Um, dynamite melon soda jelly. This melon flavored jelly is a refreshing dessert and drink all in one. Melon soda is a classic summer drink and is perfect in this unique snack. Okay, I got a story here. A long while back, Japan Crate did a promotion called the Lucky Crate, in which you would get all kinds of random stuff. Pretty much random stuff. And you would get you could potentially get a big prize. And I believe the the one I got had like a scratcher for like a percentage code off the side or something. I never did that. We did the video. I was in a different position. I was over on Chuck's bed. Um, or whatever it was at the time. I was sitting there and we had, and one of the items was this. I got a bowl here. I'll explain why. We didn't realize how to do this. Chuck cut it off the top here. See that? And the drink flew all over the place. Meaning that it was messy, I get a bit splattered on me, and I cussed. We did not like that. Right now it was in fact. So there's this little bendy part here. I have the bowl here in case it spills out. Now I'm gonna use the scissors. I'm gonna use scissors. I'm not no, I'm not gonna. So, uh, there's this thing I got cut open. Oh, crap. Did, did I get some on me? No. It's, oh, it's on the scissors. Of course it is. Um, put this over here. Hold on a minute. I apologize. So, I got some squirted into the shot glass here. And as you can see, it's very gelatin -y and Smell good. weird. It tastes chunky. I don't like, no, no, I don't, no, 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 screw you. No. It, it's okay. There's no sugar. Yeah, no, I'm not, no, no, screw you, no, 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 no. Hey, guess what? Hey, guess what? Big load, load of no for you. Good morning, John. Why are you pouring water into your shot glass? Because I have a drink to do. Okay, and at this point we are four, four minutes. Uh, well, the first item that's because it's such a. I had a story to tell. Okay. So there you go. I had a story to tell. There's the reason why it was four minutes. Now don't dump on me. Okay. Next up, as usual, I'll open up these boxes uh, beforehand just to see if I need to put anything in the fridge, like just say chocolate or the drink, uh, which I will get to. I saw this and I busted out laughing. This is... <sighs> Sing along if you know the words! Fresh does better with men, does freshness. Fresh does better with men, does fresh and full of life. Men. Fresh men. Yes, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Only Japan can come up with this! You know the meme on Mentos and Diet Coke? Mentos and Coke!
Mentos French Cola. <laughs> These Coke flavored Mentos are a refreshing snack for all those who are fans of Coke or Mentos or both. Are people who put them together. Drain that can of soda when it's hot out for this flavorful candy classic. Am I thinking of Pop Rocks and Diet Coke? No, it's Mentos. Um, hold on a second while I try to figure out how to open this. Ah, that ain't no bad machine for it. So this is what a Mentos Cola looks like. It's a, it's a, it's a sort of a thick, uh, it looks like a big M&M, but kind of a bit, uh, obviously thicker. Um, just the thing, I never had Mentos before. Uh, Mentos are like, mints, I think? I don't know, I don't know what Mentos are. I know they make your mouth, they, they mouth, they make your mouth smell fresh or something. Mentos and Coke. Japan. Japan. Still sunny inside. I want to try Mentos, but at this point, I give you a more accurate. Um. Summary of how this tastes any different than regular Mentos. I have it. And it's definitely interesting clear. Mentos Fresh Cola. Of course it is. <laughs> this is why I love Japan, folks. They, they come up with some strange takes on on brands you already know and love. And Mentos Cola, what am I saying? Ah! Next up is... Uh, something I should probably get open before I show you. Hold on. This, this is... Fitz gum, lemon flavor. A long-lasting lemon taste in one of Japan's favorite gums is sweet and tart. The absolute best for refreshing gum on the go this summer. By the way, in the booklet here, which um, by, by the way, this is the uh, this is the cover image. By the way, um, this is below, right below the original box's um, lemon popcorn. Um, last time I got Fitz in a Japan crate, which is the first time I ever had Fitz, was a, um, was a Where's Wally, uh, box over as well, but a few of those outside of the, in certain territories such as the United States. Um, so basically what it is, basically, I don't remember the flavor there, but the wrappers had, like, Waldo characters on them. Um, this, this doesn't have anything on except plain, uh, stuff. There's the gum. There's like 12 of these in the box. Show them more tall than lemon popcorn. You know, I said more tall than lemon popcorn, and then my, all of a sudden my mouth was open. I mean, it's certainly better than most of them. The most limited things I've had. And we're approaching 10 minutes. Of course. Um, I always do drink last, so here's the bonus of this month. Oh, yes. That is a donut. These are fancy donuts. Toy. It says do not eat here. No, this isn't actually a donut, though. It sure looks like one. These squishy toys are fun to play with to use as a stress ball. And to play within the pool, it floats during the summertime. Here's the problem. This is not a squishy one. This is actually a hard one. Um, as you can see, I'm squeezing here and it's not doing anything, but uh, there it is. There's the bag. I'm not gonna open it up since it's really there's really nothing to it and it's not separable to my knowledge. Uh, 
Uh, anyway, boxed up. The drink. And this is what I'm kind of looking forward to since uh, I saw those. Like, oh. From Grand Time, this. Ice Cocoa. I ever fantasized about having an iced hot chocolate as a kid? Say no more, because this version of hot chocolate not only makes drinking cocoa as easy as up and in a can of soda, but also lets you enjoy a wintertime favorite as a refreshing beverage during the hottest days of the year. I love chocolate. I love chocolate drinks. And, as you can no doubt tell. Um, <laughs> so, when I saw this uh, and I read the description, I was like, So that's why I clean up the shot glass here. So, uh, oh, crap. Okay, that's fine. Fine, I'll take care of that later. Yeah, I'm gonna that. Right now. That's what it looks like. Looks like a. Yeah. Hold on a sec. I apologize. I was holding the wrong end. Uh, there we go. Better look at it. Smells like cocoa. It does smell like, it does kind of smell like, uh, hot chocolate. Maybe milk. Yeah, it does. Yeah, well, they're not wrong. It does taste like hot chocolate. Just not the kind that uses milk. And there's a distinct difference the flavor between hot chocolate that uses milk and hot chocolate that just uses water. That is that is definitely the water-based hot chocolate. So <clears throat> Ah, not a fan of that at all. Um, so, best and worst of the lot here, um, this box, in the, in these, the, this group, um, best was probably the Mentos. By, by far the Mentos, yeah. Mentos, the gum, um, the hot chocolate, and then the soda jelly. Best and worst of the box, Ooh. Oh, best would probably be the Mentos. Worst, worst would probably be the Star Candy because I'm, not, I'm just not a fan of those. No, 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 the popcorn. Star Candy is at least sugar, at least sugar. The popcorn is just like. So that's it. That is it for this month's Japan Cream videos. Hope you enjoy them. Um, if you like to get Japan Cream for your very own. Um, the premium costs 30 bucks, and that includes shipping. That's pretty good. If you don't want to get your pain crate, then they have other kinds of boxes. They have Doki Doki Crate, which is Japanese Q7 of Japan, Umai Crate, which is Japanese noodles, and Kiriko Crate, which is Japanese food packs. Those all cost 30 bucks each as well. So, go out, have yourself a good time, JapanCrate.com. Check them out. They all they got all kinds of great stuff. They got a shop where you can buy, I think, individual items or something like that, in case you like the item and you want to get it again. Nothing in here really struck me as saying, they said the Mentos is really maybe something I'd get again. But uh, maybe that'll change with uh, the repeated. And as I'm doing this, this is August 4th. Yesterday, I got this. That's right, it is August 2017. I expect that within the next few weeks or so. I'll be doing that later in the month just uh, to give a bit of space between that and this. Might see Chuck in there too. So. With all that said, and with that preview of stuff, I have been John Lawrence. Thank you for your time. Keep snapping. Probably a good catchphrase, but I don't know.